For cheap and reliable FIFA coins, go to fifar.com. Check out the link in the description. What's up, guys? I'm Tomer FC Evan, and welcome back to the Liverpool Carrier Mode Show. I'm bringing you an early upload today, and if you want to see a second upload, get this video to 500 likes and uh, also leave a comment what are your predictions for the Liverpool Swansea game it's a huge game for Liverpool because uh, most of Liverpool's rivals dropped points and we are playing Valencia this is the Champions League second leg of the last 16 tie we drew the first leg 1-1 Let's see what we can do in the second leg come on boys I believe this is Anfield Let's try and get to the quarterfinals of the Champions League. We won it last season, but this season it will be even more difficult. Oh my god! Wow! Dani Parejo almost scored for Valencia, man! Ref! Come on! I think I will give it to Royce because he is just one of our best. Free kick takers, Royce! Yes! Marco Royce! Ow! What a free kick! Yes! That was beast! Happy Royce! The whole team is group hugging. Just sit back and watch this again. Marco Royce, what a hit! Goalkeeper, no chance! Ah, oh, it's in the back of the head even before the goalkeeper starts diving. Wow! Get in roll! Oh, Sterling, I see you! Sterling! Sterling, what is that? Finish your dinner, come on! Oh? Markovic! Coutinho, please! Ah. We are dominating though. Oh, come on, Royce, I see you. Oh! Royce! Oh, damn! Keeper saves it. What a run, Royce. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Oh! No! What have I done? You, Leno, big save. So I'm making some substitutions, so this will be how my team will shape up Emre Can and Henderson to add some steel in midfield and Lacazette up front. Hopefully we can get that second goal and seal the qualification because at 1-0 it's a very dangerous scoreline. Oh, whoa, 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 no, no, no! They equalized, I can't believe it, from a cross as well. If this stays the same, we go into extra time. Just a simple cross, and they scored. Ah! Moreno, come on! Oh my goodness, how close was that? Come on, Royce. Royce, Royce, Royce! Bang! 88 minutes! Come on! Yes! We have done it! Look at that! Oh, that touch by Royce! That was beautiful! He just stops the ball with his leg, shields the ball with his chest and flicks it onto his left foot and rams it home. Come on, Royce. Go on, son. Royce! Fist in the game! Oh, <laughs> Royce makes it free! This guy is just unbelievable! He gets a hat-trick in such a big game! Come on, Royce! Brilliant! Absolutely fantastic goal! Again, what a waste of a performance! Wow! Boom! We are through to the next round of the Champions League! Marco Royce with an absolutely incredible hat-trick and we deserved it! Look at all the chances! We played Valencia off the park but we still had to work so so hard to get this win and who else but Royce was man of the match, 4 shots, 3 goals. So here are all the latest Champions League results and amazingly Barcelona knocked out Man City on penalties, Bayern Munich knocked out Paris Saint-Germain, um, yeah 4-2 on aggregate, let's see, uh, Milan are through against Lyon, uh, 
what did Tottenham do? Let's let's check out. Yeah, Tottenham lost on away goals to Benfica. So one of the English teams are out. Man City are out as well. And uh, yeah, Chelsea are out <laughs> against Dortmund. That, that's good because I, in the Champions League I prefer to play foreign teams, not the English teams. And, uh, and yeah, of course, Real Madrid are through against Roma. So let's see who do we get in the quarterfinals. Oh my god, Bayern Munich again. Just like last season. Remember that Sterling masterclass when we beat Bayern 5 0, but this time with the sliders it will be a lot more difficult. And, uh, and yeah, the only other ties like Real Madrid play Milan, Dortmund play Zenit, Barcelona play Benfica, so we were quite unlucky with the draw. But you know, we have to beat every big team if you want to win the Champions League. Uh, no question about that. Let me show you the Youth Academy just very quickly. I think I will promote this guy maybe in the May update, after the May update, after his overall uh, gets increased. And this guy definitely with a, with a left winger, he looks like a really uh, big prospect. Also Eduard Rios, the Brazilian. And we could play him in my Brazilian national team, you know, in one or two uh, years because he looks like a really big talent, so that's why I, I scouted in, uh, in Brazil and oh, this guy, even though his overall is not the best, his, his potential is, is crazy good and we have two, two goalkeepers coming through, a Spanish and uh, an English goalkeeper and they both have crazy good potential and pretty decent overall already and uh, it was a long time ago when I last show you, showed you the squad report. So let's take a look at all the players and how they are developing. Some of the players went up in their ratings. Uh, Bernd Leno, I wanted to talk about this guy. Nine clean sheets in 14 games. That's amazing. I mean, Mignolet didn't even creep, keep one clean sheet until like, what, November or something like that? And Leno came in, he was a beast of a signing, I'm so happy we signed him because he has been an absolute revelation in goal and he won a lot of points for us this season. A good, goal, a good goalkeeper can win you 10 to 12 points a season and that's vital and also it's vital that Liverpool get a really good goalkeeper in real life. And I'm happy with how the young players are developing. Marco, which is growing very nicely. Sterling, not though, which is a little bit concerning. But Royce, 17 goals in 33 games. It has been amazing. And also Sturridge, 19 goals, 10 assists in 35 games. So very happy. Ilori, very nicely growing. So I'm happy that we sold off. Um, yeah, we, I'm happy we sold off Skirtal and Sako asked for a transfer. We couldn't do much about that. Lacazette, 9 goals, 10 assists, a very good signing, a very solid player. Henderson didn't play in the Champions League because he was absolutely knackered from the previous game, but we still went through, that's the most important thing. And, uh, and yeah, Joe Osborne, I will try to send him out alone, the Gerard region, and these are the youth kind of players, Soriano, Vaquero, they are growing very, very nicely, Dominguez as well, but they need some loan, loans uh, to develop you know, because they are just a little bit short of a first team quality. Uh, Susu on the other hand, he played quite a few games, he's a good centre midfielder and uh, left, he can play on the left, he can play on the right if, uh, if I need him to. And Luis Alberto, yeah, he only played one game and he scored in the, <laughs> in the Champions League, how amazing is that? And um, yeah, Nathan Klein. Um, has been just a very very good signing as well. John Joshabi, I played him uh, in, um, in my uh, co-op seasons new series which is coming soon. Us uh, against the world uh, with subscribers and I played with Swansea and John Joshabi was very impressive. He scored a really nice goal. So I will play him uh, I think in the upcoming uh, Liverpool episodes. So here are all the players um, Squad reports. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this episode. Don't forget to leave a like and leave a comment. What are your predictions for the Liverpool Swansea game? And thanks for watching, guys. Stay awesome. Have a lovely day. Goodbye.